Hey, what's going on, y'all? Jimmy Macro. Before you skip ahead, not knocking it, I'm just saying. These were put on Patreon a while ago, these Parts of Adventures episodes. However, I lost the words portion, the review portion of it. So I'll be doing that afterwards, as of the current moment, instead of my thoughts back then. Anyway, it's the Shaw episode, Shaw's back! Let's get to it. I was a Shaw. Sir, implanting an electronic microchip this close to her brainstem is incredibly Thank risky. you, Doctor. I expect Miss Shaw to be much more accommodating from here. Ah, uh, that's why. I'm gonna begin. Oh, Shaw, I don't want to see this shit. I love that. Our pet goes under the knife again. And if she becomes a slobbering vegetable? Well, brain damage is small price to pay if we can turn Mashore into a valuable asset. Damn, she bought a chip. Oh, I love her so much. This is sad. She bought a chip, microchip, in her brain. Shaw becomes a team player after our next visit to the OR. Dead or alive. What the fuck? This shit in her head. I'm getting that vibe. It's all too whatever. I don't like this at all. BMW and Nori. As hash to kill with a double of Chan Sadi Dura for the moon, Nichan. Guess him out of the money, Mikone. I know she's not. You'll see. Looks like your name is up. Uh, yeah, hi. I'm calling from the city square pharmacy on 20. That's brilliant. I love her so much. Batter up. <laughs> Order said to bring you back. Didn't say to bring you back alive. Say, so, that was stupid. Can't either. What the fuck is going on? Oh. I was not ready for this episode at all. You like this too, but it's probably gonna suck. I just get this damn thing out of me. Did you even look for me? Of course we did. Not hard enough. Left you uh, some get well whiskey in the bar. I can't knock up being pissed. I move you. Yeah, there you go. Are you willing? I mean, it's fantastic. Do I groove you? It doesn't feel something feels off to me. Is it just me? I mean, not with this. This is really fun. But I mean, just the way she chose the acting. I could just be nervous. Good. Ah! It's me. 
taking the fight to Samaritan right now. And I'm going to destroy it once and for all. My dear Samaritan, have you relocated to me, Sean, or her associates? I love that. Do with me what you will. Torture. Kill. You know, I was hoping you'd say that. Hell, I was you. And one of the qualities you all have in common, you always have an out. And you built the damn thing, so you must have an off switch. Be a dear and wake me up when you're done asking the same question. <laughs> Please, please, Samin. Let's plug it in. This is all horseshit. There's no way any of this is happening. I need to go to a more private place. <laughs> Shh. <Mitchell>? all? <laughs> <laughs> Samin, what are you doing? <laughs> Samin? Like I said, you need some rest. Miss Groves, let's get you a proper bandage. This is definitely horseshit. This might be my final resting place. Everybody's acting weird, like not how they usually act. Even Gris, like a giant smile. He never smiles like that. What the fuck is going on? It was your idea to plant the USB in my arm. Ingenious, really. It is a kill switch. Only not the kind your friends are expecting. We broke you months ago. <laughs> Escape. Because we let you. Now, be a good girl and lead us to the machine and the base of its operations. Then we can all go home. What the fuck? All right, this is trippy as balls. I don't really kind of understand what's going on. What I'm seeing real. Shall I do all this? What's going on? You got something to say? You better not have been saying it. Did you want him? Not a chance in hell. Do you dream? That's a lot of blood. Dream. No, this can't happen. Yeah, it's fake. You have to get out of there. I'll come find you, bring you back. Bitch is acting fucking off. There's something I need to tell you. About Reese. We can wait till we're home safe. But when things got to be too bad, there was one place I would go to in my mind. You. Aww. All nonsense. Look at Greer, Reese, and fucking Samane in one shot. Stop it. Knock it off. I don't think any of them can die before the series is even over. One episode. Knock it off. Sir, she blew her brains out again. And she didn't lead us any closer to the machine's location. Wow. She waited an extra hour before she shot you. How uplifting. <laughs> Simulation 6,742. Jesus. All right. That was episode four of season five of Person of Interest. Shaw is back. I must say, I really like this episode. Um, though, from watching it and editing it just now, I could see I, I figured out uh, the Shaw twist rather early on. And I will say the most effective thing to get me on board was Greer telling us that um, this is all his plan. Essentially, to have her bring him to the church, to get the chip, to the fucking doomsday device, etc, etc, etc. But I would imagine most people figured out that this was a dream sequence. Once you kill John, it's like, come on. Uh, you kill John and Greer in the same episode? Like, come on, son. Come on, son. The fuck out of here with that bullshit. Um, very happy to have Shaw back. Apparently her pregnancy was done at this point. Uh, the actual actress. 
Um, sex, I know a lot of you, some of you, had a problem with Shaw and Root sex scene. First of all, I have no problems with that for obvious reasons. How, is it gratuitous? Maybe. Uh, you'll get no complaints out of me, especially when it's in her head. Um, I will say, if this is what Shaw thinks, I'm a little hurt that she feels that way about uh, Finch. That, you know, action's not really your thing. It hurt my feelings a little bit. I ain't gonna lie to you. I ain't gonna lie to you. <sighs> but Shaw's a savage. She's a badass. And while I have fallen in love with Root, uh, even more so in her absence, I am happy to have her back on the show in a more consistent role. Anyway, um, post your comments down below. Like, share, subscribe.